Yo, hey guys, doing no fat. Hey guys, doing no fat day. Uh, no fat day. You know, day. No fat day four of nine because after busting them nuts, cause about four days approximately, I have been we got straight. Yeah, you guys. Um. Y'all was probably thinking, oh damn, this dude probably about to relapse again, then go be, be going for another month. Nah, bro, this time um, I'm serious. Yeah, I know, I know, I said that a lot, but um, no. Um, it's one thing when you start to think, like, um, when you, honestly, when you think about it, when you relapse, when, when you have a porn addiction, can you really ever, like, live your best life still being addicted to something that you, still doing something that you've been addicted to since you were, like, 12 years old? You can't really live your best life, um, you know, dealing with a, with a, with a quote unquote porn addiction because. And energy and motivation that that's 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 vital to to success. And my, and my, well, I guess motivation to success, so kind of one and one. Um, the energy, the energy is gone. You know, you know the, the, that um motivation is important. And it's one thing, you know, because obviously we all know someday we're not gonna feel motivated. But um, when you when when your dopamine levels, which affects like your mood and whatever, or your your, your motivation. When they're uh, abnormally low, like way lower than where it's supposed to be due to, due, due to the addiction, um, um, uh, I guess motivation can be like even lower than you know a normal person would. Because uh, again, we all have days where we're not motivated to do things, but um, I guess when, when your motivation is even lower than that, it's like, I guess I, I said before how you know I've had time where I'm just. <laughs> You know, a couple of days after we left, I'm just laying in bed like I just feel like a I feel like like lifeless. Like I have literally no energy. It's like my energy levels have reached zero. And I'm just laying in bed like a like a dead fish. Just like I, I, mean, I can't move, man. I'm just feel literally just like I can't move. I'm just don't feel like doing nothing. Just feel like a zombie, and it's, it doesn't feel fun. Um, you know, it doesn't feel fun, but uh, um, that's the definitely that's the price you pay for addiction. Um, well, you know, specifically porn addiction because it really just zaps that motivation. Um, I know one thing. Um, everybody has a relapse cycle. Uh, you know, everybody has a everybody has a um a relapse cycle that they go through um, with porn. Um, and obviously, of course, that um the feeling of no low energy, just completely zombie like state, usually follows after a relapse and a binge. Specifically, I feel like a binge. When me for me recently, uh, it hasn't really been a binge per se. Like maybe like three faps or whatever. And like in the next few days, I'm just completely like, like zombie like. It's how it happened. Like I said before, just like any other addiction, when you see people like high on meth or whatever, they may they feel good maybe for the rest of that day, but a few days later, they actually probably like a day later, they don't have their head. They start to even 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 not even not even that. It's like after the high wears down, the crash. Your body crashes because when you put your body at that high of a level, eventually it has to come down. Like caffeine, but more extreme. Hey, it rhymes. But I'm saying, like, you know, when, when you watch porn, you relapse, and obviously you feel more, a little more relaxed. A lot of guys say they feel awkward. Then you do, you know, me personally, when I relapse, I feel I'm, <laughs> I'm already clumsy. I've been clumsy my whole life. Literally, I've been clumsy my whole life. But, um, uh, uh literally, I've been clumsy my whole life. <laughs> but uh, when I relapse, I notice that, um, <laughs> I'm more fidgety. I drop stuff more. I'm just it, it just multiplies times fifty thousand, and um, but uh, um, one thing with um, <laughs> this just happened now. One thing I know who also a point is that um, do your your short term memory is horrible, bro. Like you forget points. You you, just, you literally just had a point in your mind. You just forget it just that quick. It's fucking horrible. But um, uh, don't do one thing with um. You know the one thing with porn is everybody has a relapse cycle. Well, um, you like, well, and then um, if you uh, you know, once you get your once you get your current or drug of choice, you know, for example, like heroin, whatever. Um, once that um, you know, once that that little period of like you feeling good goes goes away, like once you relapse, you just you know you kind of you know you 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 feel kind of um calmer, <laughs> actually a little more confident, not true confidence, but you just feel more calm in your body, your mind. Your thoughts may not be that, that horrible, whatever problem that you were relapsing subconsciously, normally or unknowingly, you were relapsing to cope with the pain. Whatever problems you're running from kind of seem like they're not, not there like that. Sometimes sometimes you, your problems may feel worse maybe after the relapse, but a couple hours after the relapse, you're not really feeling all that anxious. You Your problems on that don't seem that big. 
But guess what happens? A day and a half, day and a half later, maybe, fam, it hits you. <laughs> you in bed, it's like 2 o'clock in the afternoon. You, you in bed, like, damn, okay, I'm going to go to the library. Bam. You don't feel like doing nothing. It's almost like it hits you, like, I don't know, like, just just feeling up, just not, like, not wanting to do anything. And um, it, it, it's been happening to me, like, the past, like, maybe, like, six months, whatever, after we left, and you know, it, it puts you in that zombie state. But um, it's all part of the addiction, man. But um, everybody has a relapse cycle. For me personally, obviously, of course, you, we know at, the, at at a certain point we know our relapse cycle, quote unquote relapse cycle. But um, the thing is, is that uh, that feeling of addiction, of relapsing, uh, we're in such that we're in that loop so hard is that it gets hard. <laughs> no point in it. It gets hard to um. When you get the urge, man, it's gonna be you, you either put up or shut up time. Uh, you can't really, ain't no strategy that's going, you know, that's going, <laughs> ain't no strategies that really that you can use to not have urges, man. You're going to have urges. And at that point, when you, it's time to see if you're really that serious. Um, one thing I noticed is that my, you guys can put your relapse cycle in the comment section, but I know mine is um, personally, before I relapse, say I'm on a decent streak. I usually, when I'm on a good, I'm, I'm still a little momentum on the streak, I usually have, a, like, Maybe a lot of good days in the world. I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. Feeling good. I have really good energy going. I'm starting to get my habits back up. I'm starting to eat healthier. Play the video games less. Um, just be more fo overall focused. Walking out more. I'm, I feel like I'm you know, making good shots. Um, <laughs> like two, three days before I relapse, it starts to go downhill. Maybe even four days. It starts to go downhill. I'll stop doing. Maybe I, maybe if I'm waking up, maybe if I'm waking up early, thirty minutes earlier than I usually do. I wake up one day, I, mean, I don't feel like waking up. I mean, put the alarm clock back. Um, I'm eating healthy foods, but I don't feel like eating this anymore, man. So I eat some, eat fast food. Um, I noticed that um, I use, I wake up in the one time, I may use my phone for, I may use my, I, be, I may be on my phone for maybe like 15 minutes before I hop in the shower, wasting time. Or I may um, eat, eat, eat a lot of candy, a lot of sugar. One time I noticed that with my, with my, um, with my, um, I noticed that with my like with with my uh, relapse cycle specifically that um sweets man it's like man I start to gorge on sweets and just eat like, eat more sweets and I noticed that it's starting to really like feed that it's it's really building up that relapse at that that point of, that point of relapse it's starting to build up to it and then the next thing I know um um I don't feel like studying for I don't feel like studying I don't feel like doing work I don't feel like doing nothing and it hits dinner hits bam urge happens. At that point, what you gonna do? You've been following, you've been failing your your, your, your habits. So like I, like I said, plenty of time. Once you relapse mentally, the physical relapse is inevitable because you already you already relapsed mentally when you stop doing your habits and you stop going down here. You start to notice yourself. Just 